Welcome back to the Iron Man Road to Completion Escape series. It's week 29, 28? Something like that. I think it's 28. Anyway, um, I didn't make a clip yesterday to actually start the week. So this is the second day of this week. Yeah, it seems kind of lazy or something like that, but I just spent the entire day woodcutting like one might expect. Same with today, except that I'm doing my second hour of Heaven Agility right now. And, uh, yeah, 97 woodcutting, 142k away from 98, and puts me just around uh, 1.4 million left to go for the 99. Um, but with that being said, uh, I did do quite a bit of ivy earlier, um, actually, like, the entire augmentation there. Uh, I'd gotten my hatchet to level 12, siphoned it, picked up 97 invention, and then uh, started working on ivy. Um, but if you look here in the bank... There we go, 72.4k teak. Also want to show something off here. Uh, I have two raven eggs now. I had never gotten one until uh, just a few days ago. I've been picking up a lot of bird's nests and... Let's see, I'm up to 644 crushed nests here, and I probably have a ton of low-level tree seeds. Yeah, 26 maples, 100 willows, 142 acorns, decent number of you and magics there, actually. That'll be quite a few farming levels. And then uh, I got some fruit tree seeds as well that, that also add up over time. Uh, but anyway, I got two raven eggs, which I hadn't really seen before. I didn't know they existed. I'd only ever seen the god uh, bird eggs until that point. And I'd, you know, I've gone through quite a few of these eggs. You know, you get them for miscellanea uh, in bird nests all the time. So I'm just going to save those two. I don't know if they're really something to collect. But yeah, they seemed rare to me. And on to day 192, figured it was finally time to start taking care of ARC mini-quests, and I did some more teaks this morning. Uh, oh, there's the end of Flagfall, for one. Uh, but I did some more teaks this morning, and I think I've got probably enough to just stop doing teaks for now. So, there we go. 76.7k teaks and 1.5k special teak logs. That's gonna save me a lot of money. Um, but yeah, that's what I ended up at. Uh, it should be enough for 99 construction, uh, between that and, like, monthly god statues, that sort of thing. Uh, and I've started doing the arc. Uh, I did one contract so far whenever I was completing Flagfall just there. And, uh, yeah, gonna start working on those mini-quests. I do want to note, though, that I've never experienced the arc. I don't know too much about it, so anything I'm doing for chimes, it's probably going to be inefficient. I just know that I have to do stuff. Like, I need to make chimes, I need to earn Taijutu, and, like, unlock everything in here, I believe. All of these locked things, and get, like, all of these unlocks. Yeah, that's, that's, that's all I know, so I'm just gonna do that. And there's Head of the Family complete. Uh, pretty good rewards for that, uh, though it did take me a little while to complete. Uh, let's just go ahead and rub that. Nice, 17.7k agility. And after doing a little bit of stuff in the arc, I uh, came to do some mining, and this is in my uh, first hour. I might do one other hour after this, uh, but I hit 85 smithing. Uh, so I've now unlocked rune, and I can do the, I think, a rune dagger and, and stuff like that. Uh, pretty cool. And uh, it also means that any of the, like, XP tier lowest level skill will continue to go to farming, uh, at least for the time being. So I believe it's now day 195, if I'm keeping track of time right. Um, I have a lot of stuff going on right now, like it's the week before final, so I have a paper to write and all kinds of studying that I've been taking care of. Um, so yeah, I'm not even going to bother like trying to put together enough clips for this week. I'm just going to make it another uh, two-week uh, video. I'll put up something probably today or tomorrow uh, just to explain why. Probably like at my normal, normally scheduled upload time, I'll throw a video up saying no upload this week, but you know, one for the next week. Uh, but anyway, I just did a daily challenge, pickpocket heroes. Uh, hadn't logged in for like over 24 hours. Um, because I've been really bogged down. Uh, but then I went and did my ports, and I've started to look at CAG's uh, ports encyclopedia uh, to see, you know, start getting things in order for me to um, finally comp. 
so right now I'm going to go to my marked uh, island. It has a golden bamboo spot and like a crablet spot and ancestral energy. It's really not that great of an island in the arc, but it's it's okay. You know, a golden bamboo is going to get me uh, at least to that 99 wood cutting. Uh, so I'm going to go work on that, and then I'll probably go work on some thieving later on tonight. Uh, yeah, I just want to start working on that thieving, especially because I need um, level 90 thieving for the ports adventurer uh, for the trio that I want to do, which is the lacquer one, uh, and doing a trio mission is a comp rec. Okay, enough rambling, uh, on to the gains. And there's the completion of Spiritual Enlightenment. Uh, also, I got really lucky and um, got a... Uh, it's not going to show up in the chat, but I did a contract for uh, killing these guys. Uh, one of my daily contracts uh, from Waco. Uh, so I get some chimes as well. And, well, quite a bit of Slayer XP. Alright, so it's on to day 197. This is actually the start of week 29. Uh, yeah, I ended up not uploading for last week, like I said, um, but with this, oh, okay, come on, I'll just crystal mask, fine, go back to doing what I was doing, uh, but with this pickpocket, there we go, that's a pretty big level, right there, 90 thieving, um, yeah, so I'm just gonna stay here until probably, uh, 91, maybe 92, uh, and then just I'll go start cycling in Prif. So whenever I see um, one of the available clans show up as a voice of Saren, I'll go and do my three pickpockets, and eventually my thieving will make its way up to 99. And not too long later, uh, picked up 90 agility. Nice, that means I got two ports adventures unlocked today, that being the Tengu and the Convict. So, yeah, quite a few new story missions to take care of. On to day 198, and I missed the clip. I wasn't paying enough attention, but I picked up 99 woodcutting. Uh, yeah, I know, I've been doing bamboo over here, but hey, it's it's pretty good. And uh, what it comes down to is free chimes. So that's like 1300 times whatever, I don't, I don't remember the math. I think it's like two chimes a piece or something for normal bamboo. Uh, but anyway, there's 99 woodcutting. Let's go pick up that cape in Falador. What's up, Wilfred? I like that cape that you got on, man. Let's see. Yes, please. And... No problem. Oh, well, I clicked the wrong... thing. Sorry, just woke up, guys. Uh, no problem. There we go. There's the woodcut cape. T. That's... okay? I don't know. I, I guess they really needed to trim that name. Uh, but yeah, nice. It actually looks really nice. I quite like that. Awesome. <laughs> Alright, after yet another day skip, it's now day 201. Yeah, I know. Sorry about that, guys, but now uh, my paper is done and turned in, so there's one final, and then I took two tests today, which was lovely. Uh, one being at 7 a.m., uh, which is a 20-minute walk away. I just, I got up at 5, and I am not happy. Uh, but anyway, it's back to the gains time. Uh, Friday, I have one more test to take care of, uh, but I can study that morning before it. Take the test, I'll be fine. Uh, and anyway, that's not going to be a bother for this video, because this video will be going up the day I'm taking the test, probably right before it. Uh, but yeah, I have been working on some fletching. I did a few hours of mining here and there. Uh, you see... I have some target set. I think that's for level 90. Uh, so I've got about 1.1 million left for 90. I uh, got a little bit of smithing XP, of course, and then uh, did some agility. I think I did a few hours of Heffen. And as you can see here, my fletching is getting quite close to level 94. Uh, back onto maple shield bows. I've uh, done a few daily challenges, tried to keep up with those. Uh, and one of them was fletching, of course. Uh, I got back some magic logs. Um, but there we go. I've gone through about 4,000 more maple logs. Got 8k banked up here, so I'm just going to keep powering through those. I uh, really need to get 96. As you can see, my target is set. 1.75 million to go. Uh, and that's just so that I can make the bundles of bamboo. Um, but I'm not too worried about it. Once I get 94, I can banner boost and take care of those and just go ahead and cash in for some chimes then. 
Um, but yeah, I'm going to be working on some mining, trying to get 90. Uh, going to go kill some vires, probably. Um, but I do need to get seed aside soon, so that's something I'll probably work on before I go kill those guys. And uh, yeah, yeah, back to progress. So I went and did a little bit of fun stuff. Oh, I should change that to chest plate. Uh, went over to Artie and finished up everything except for this. Uh, it's the last part of the Artie task set. Uh, yeah, I even did the Castle Wars game, and I won it. I made sure I won 5-0, to zero, and I only got two silver tickets instead of two gold. Don't know why, uh, but anyway, I need to get to 91 smithing for this. Now, I have a lot of smithing resources saved up. Uh, I have some mithril, some addy, and like 25k coal or something like that, so I'm going to burn through it here. Um, but I don't think that's going to get me that much higher. Uh, so I'm going to try to get to maybe about 87 through this, and then going and doing some more uh, concentrated gold mining, uh, superheating. And uh, yeah, then I'll just like boost up to 91, take care of that for the arty task set. So that's what I'm working on right now. Oh yeah, and I'm not entirely sure, but I think in total I have, uh, I don't know, about 6k uh, Mithril and 6k Addy. I can't remember the exact numbers because I've already thrown them in here. Uh, I just know there wasn't enough room for uh, all of the Addy, and all of the Mithril did fit. So, it's something. You know, I've got a lot of resources. I'm just going to burn through them. Alright, on to the next day, second to last day of this two-week period. Uh, that meaning the next day is the end of week 29. Uh, ran through all of my mithril, and I'm now working on my Addy. Uh, you can see I've got up to 46% respect, which is uh, actually quite a bit. Uh, but there we go. That is 87 smithing. Uh, now, I don't actually know how much XP is needed. It's about 400k. I actually have enough coal and adamant ore to make it all the way to 88. And then I can do a fairly easy plus 3 boost. Uh, just to take care of that last achievement diary for uh, Artie. Yeah, so I'm just going to sit here like all day, because it takes forever to, to use Art Artisan's Workshop. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's, that's all. That's all that's going on. On to the last day of this week, day number 203. I'm heading down... Oh, wow, this sounds really loud. Uh, okay, I'm heading down to Yenil just made this rune crossbow. Alright, and with that I have now completed both the hard and the elite Ardune tasks. Uh, so, where's Alec? There we go. Let's talk to him a few times, and as you can see here, I now have 89 smithing, just did a simple banner boost, uh, and I'm sitting at 87 mining, almost all the way to 88. Um, so, talk about the task system, and there's the hard Nice, Artie Cloak 3, but I'm not going to have that for too long. Let's go ahead and go straight to Artie Cloak 4. This will come in, uh, whoa, yeah, right, that's like 200k XP or something like that. But this will really come in handy once I start pickpocketing in um, Prif. So let's go ahead and rub these lamps. 50k, yeah, let's put that all into Herblore. Because I don't think there's really another choice. Let's pop that, that, oh, 28k. Alright, so it's going to be a total of 228k Herblore XP. Not bad at all. That's 140k away from 95. I'll also show here uh, just what ores I have remaining. Yeah, there's like none. 28 coal, 1800 Addy, which is a decent amount. Uh, and then I've got this 1k Runite. 1900 Corrupted Ore, which I can now smelt, and I'll be taking care of that on Treyhern Hours. Uh, but outside of that, yeah, that's it. Though it is interesting that my smithing's at 89 and my mining's at 87. For once, it actually overtook it, and uh, doing concentrated gold should flip that right back around and get them to 99 near the same time. So I messed up the clip, but it was Treyhern Hour, and I just claimed the lamp from Lady Treyhern for smithing Corrupted Ore. Uh, you can see I'm 300k from the next level. Uh, I burned through like 800 Corrupted Ore. So yeah, and then I got the 50k extra. Alright guys, finally ending off this sort of two-week special uh, with some fletching. 
Yeah, I've just been chilling, doing some maple shield bows, uh, burning through my logs again, and I have a lot to go collect from, uh, what's it called? Miscellanea, anyway. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's all I'm working on. Um, it was pretty productive for two weeks, I guess. Um, have one more final tomorrow, but after that, it is four to five weeks of straight gains. Uh, so hopefully I can round out a lot of these skills, maybe knock out uh, four or five more 99s. Uh, we'll see what happens, though. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for being patient with me. I know uh, some people were disappointed with me not being able to upload last week. Um, and if any of you are interested, yes, the finals went well. Uh, I got an A and then two B pluses. Um, yep, but that's the end of this week. Thanks for watching, guys.